Once again, this is Prince Dice of Royal Financial Investment Group coming to you guys today with another great video. As always, don't forget to like, subscribe, share, comment, all the other good stuff. Give me a thumbs down if I'm doing good. Give me a thumbs down if I suck. Leave me a comment. Let me know. Hey, you did a good job, bad job. And also, don't forget to, if you have a question, if I confuse you, anything like that, leave me a comment below and I will definitely get back to you. But today's video is going to be in response to a question that I was asked. That, hey, can you go over price type? What the heck is this? I want to sell a stock and it gave me all these options. I don't know what the heck is going on. Hey, can you explain it? But hey, once again, you clicked on the best video on YouTube. That's going to break this down and show it to you step by step. So boom, for example, I have here, the market is closed right now, but I have here Disney stock, right? I'm just pretending I was getting ready to sell Disney stock. So here you say, hey, I want to sell. I say, hey, I want to sell six of, my, six of my shares. The symbol is Disney. And boom, I come down here. Market. First of all, market means get me out immediately. Get me the best possible price right now. You know, I don't care if it's high, low. I just want out. And it's going to get you out immediately. Right? So the next one down. Market on close. Today, when the market closes, sell. I don't care what the price is. When the market closes today, sell. Simple and easy, right? The next one, limit. Sell for this particular price. What the particular price could be, 105, 106, or 107, whatever, right? And it's going to ask you down here how long you want this term. Term means how long you want, how long is this offer good for? Is it just good for the day? Is it good for 60 days? Whatever. So limit means I want it for this particular price. You type in your price. I don't want it any higher. I don't want it any lower. I just want it for this particular price. Next one, stop on quote. Stop on quote means that. I want you, when the price starts to drop below this particular thing, let's say Disney is trading for $106 right now. When this price drops below $104, get me out. Right? I don't care what it is. When, when this stock shoots below $104, get me out. The next one we have, stop limit, stop on quote. Stop on limit, stop quote is going to give you the opportunity to get a little bit of mix of both. And over here, a stop limit is you can put in your particular price. You can say, hey, sell it for this particular price, and you can put in a stop price as well. That, hey, this stock is doing good, but if it drops below this price, get me out. Then we're going to drop to the next one, trailing stop by dollars. I want to trail this stock by $1. So as long as this stock is going up, I'm good. But as soon as it turns around and drops by $1, get me out. That's essentially what it says. So Disney is at 106 right now. Once it goes 107, 110, 112, keep me in. But as soon as it drops by $1, I'm trailing it. I'm following it. And as long as it's going up, keep me in. But as soon as it drops its value by $1, get me out. The next one, trailing stop by percentage. The same exact thing is trailing price, but this one is by percentage. I want to follow it by 1%. As long as it's going up, keep me in, keep me in. But as soon as it loses its value by 1%, Get me out. Sell me. And you have your terms down here. Is it good for 60 days? Is it good for the day? Or whatever. So hopefully I didn't confuse you. Hopefully I helped you guys out. Um, leave a comment. Let me know what you think. Or whatever. As always, thanks for watching. Be safe.